How you doing everybody? Nick DiVirgilio here and today's video is about this pork pie little squealer four piece shell pack. If you don't know much about pork pie drums, they're made by a guy named Bill Dedimore from Southern California in the Los Angeles area, and he started the company in 1987 as a boutique shop building drums just for fun. Then he started building them for players around town. Then you, you, players would take their drums to him to get sort of hot rotted where you needed the edges redone. He's an expert at edges, and he started fixing up other guys' drums and then turned it into a drum company where he makes fantastic drums, lots of killer snare drums, really cool drum kits. The throne that I'm sitting on is fantastic. I'll show you that as well. So let's get in the details of this little squealer kit right now. Now everything in the pork pie sort of drum line all has a pig related name, hence the little squealer name of this drum kit. Now this kit comes with a nine by 13 inch rack tom, 16 by 16 inch floor tom, a 14 by 22 inch kick drum. Now shallower size kick drums are very hip these days. You also get a steel six and a half by 14 inch snare drum, all really cool sizes, big and warm sounding, perfect for rock and roll, but you could play this kit in any style of music. So let's get into the sound of the drums first, then I'll get into more details about everything else. First, the rack tom and the floor tom with the snare wires off. Let me put the snare wires back on and play these toms again for you so you can hear the buzz in the background. Very cool tone, very playable, very musical as well. All right, let's get to the kick drum. I'll put the snare wires off. And again, it's a 14 by 22. Beefy, round, punchy, the 22 size with the shallow depth of the 14 inch. It's gonna give you a nice, punchy, but low tone. Let me put the snare wires on and do that again, and then I'll play all the drums together for you as well. Give you some information here. Pork pie does not come with hardware, so I've coupled it with some great DW hardware here. And on the kick drum, I'm using one of their MMC machine direct drive kick drum pedals, and I have the plastic beater. So you're getting a little bit of snap from the plastic beater rather than a felt beater. Okay, that being said, let's play the toms and the kick drum and the snare drum all together. I'm gonna turn the snare wires off first, and then we'll talk about the snare drum.
an awful lot of fun to play, and again, big and round tone. All right, let's get to the snare drum because you get a snare drum with this shell pack. A lot of times, shell packs and drum kits don't have snare drums, but this one does. So you get a little squealer steel, six and a half by 14 inch snare drum, really punchy, came up to pitch and tune really fast. It feels good under the hand. It's got great snap to it. Here's the sound of the drum without the snare wires on. I just played it a second ago in that little playing example, but let's play it on its own. Really nice tone that projects. That steel shell makes it loud, but not doesn't hurt the ears at all, at least to me. It's got a great sustain to it. There's no dampening at all on the snare drum right now. These 2.3 millimeter hoops give you a great side stick sound. Let me demonstrate that for you. Very cool, very musical, very playable drum. So now, let's get in the detail of the hardware that is on these drums. Like I mentioned just a second ago, all of the hoops that Bill Dedimore uses on his drums are 2.3 millimeter triple flanged hoops. 2.3 millimeter means it's not too thick, not too heavy, not too dense to take away any of the resonance of the drum. These fit just perfectly for these particular drums. And he uses them again on all of his pork pie percussion drums. The rack tom here comes with a rim style tom mount, very sturdy, very easy to use. And you also, in the box, comes a tom mount that you can use with any cymbal stand, no matter what kind of hardware you use. This tom mount fits on DW's hardware stands, on DW's tom stands, I should say, and so I just put it there without using this particular one, but no matter what kind of hardware stand, or drum cymbal stand you have, this will fit on it. These pork pie drums come with very cool looking hourglass chrome plated lugs. They hold the tension rod perfectly. There's no moving out of the tension rod. The drums stay in tune, no matter how hard. You're hitting them, I've been playing these drums all day long and they're keeping their tune and their pitch really nicely. Very heavy duty and sturdy floor tom legs. Now for me that's always an impressive thing that drum companies think about that. that they give you legs that are strong and that will keep the drum in place. Same goes for the kick drum spurs. Nice kick drum spurs, the kick drum is not moving at all. They're heavy duty and they're staying in place and keeping the kick drum in place which is a great thing because you don't want your kick drum to move while you're playing, right? On this particular little squealer snare drum, you get these nice beaver tail lugs, look great. Ratchet style throw off, just pulls off to the side, very easy to use. Up and down with the snare wires. These drums are really well put together. They sound great, they play great, they're really fun and very musical. And this finish, let's talk about the finish here for a second. Fire Thorn Red. Now, a few people have walked into the video studio today and looked at these drums and they go, man, that looks like, like a hot rod car color sort of like a Ferrari red, and it is that sort of thing. It's beautiful. You get this nice high gloss lacquer on the kick drum hoops as well. So it's a great uh, color difference between the black and the red. They look really good, and the chrome hardware definitely jumps off of this beautiful red color. As with all of my videos, I encourage you to check out the text below the video. I'll have links to all of the other gear that I'm using. These Aquarian drum heads, I'll definitely give you links to all of those. These beautiful Zildjian cymbals, I'm using Constantinople crash cymbals today. These are gorgeous cymbals. 
all of the microphones, the recording gear, the computer, the computer stand, all of this stuff, you'll have links to all of it in case you want to check any of it out, which I encourage you to do so. And you can go right to those product pages and uh, look at the gear right there. There you have it, everybody. Pork Pie Percussion's Little Squealer 4P Shell Pack. If you've never tried Pork Pie drums before, I highly encourage you to check them out. These drums look, sound, and feel great. If you want any more information about this Pork Pie product or any other Pork Pie product, just contact your Sweetwater sales engineer. Thanks a lot for watching this video.